build your muscle if you're trying to lose weight and not look skinny fat that's what they call it they call it skinny fat it's like when you lose like 50 pounds and people don't really see it or you lose 70 pounds people are like did you really lose weight i think you lost weight and you're like yes i have lost 70 pounds maybe you didn't up your protein okay so today's video is gonna be different than some videos that you've seen online about how to lose weight or how to be healthy because i'm gonna go into detail i'm gonna go into the why of what i'm telling you i'm not gonna just tell you this works so do it right because you're intelligent you don't need me to tell you what you need to do but if i give you a why then you could consider it and do what you find best for you was literally esther takes 77,000. i don't even know how many times i've tried to make this video and if i actually get through this video <laughs> without anything else happening you see what i mean i am upset i am super duper upset because let me just show you i broke it I broke my camera stand, y'all. Like, oh, I did not blend my lipstick. What your am I keep forgetting about that? Oh my gosh, this is just one of those days. Can we just, just can we just give this video like a hundred likes? Let's get a hundred likes on this video, cause y'all, this video took forever. And so nothing's going wrong. And as y'all can see, your girl is as natural as can be as as far as comes to the face. So I'm just gonna take it as it is. The good news is I ain't gonna sweat here because <laughs> I got my AC on and we're good to go. All right. So the goal of this video is to help somebody. I have been on my um transformation journey for 17 weeks and it's been great and i've learned a lot and i want to share with y'all because we're in it together the human race we are here we're together let's do it so let's jump right into it the first thing that you gotta do to make sure that you don't look like you did not do anything it's all about body composition if you want your body composition to actually change you need to up your protein now you'll be thinking esther i've heard about that i know i need to but how do i even do it there are so many things you can do but one big thing you gotta make sure is that you know what you want to eat tomorrow so you know if you have enough protein in your house or if you need to or if you need to go buy your protein whey now i used to not believe in this protein whey thing i was like i'm just gonna eat my shrimps which is like an excellent amount of protein by the way i eat shrimps like almost every day but the truth is when i first started i would eat so much meat so much fish so much shrimps like i would not be able to eat anything else my other markers were suffering my calories were way low which is not healthy and then i discovered the lovely way now this is you don't know what i take but i ran out of my transform <laughs> protein so i just had to go get this so up your protein Make sure that you're planning out so that you know whether you you have enough in your house or you need to go get you can go purchase something like this, which is a game changer. Second thing you gotta do on your journey to be as healthy as possible, to lose the weight that you want to lose for yourself, is to make sure that you're sleeping. Sleep is so important. It is so underrated. It's important you need to sleep make sure that you get your sleep and you might be thinking esther how much sleep do i need you should get seven hours of sleep a day and i'm be thinking esther girl i can function on four hours of sleep you want to lose that weight girl you want your body composition to change boy is that what you want 
sleep seven hours. You might be thinking, Esther, I cannot sleep seven straight hours. I got you. Cat naps. Here's what you do. After every meal, plan every meal out to sit down and eat for 30 minutes. Finish your meal within 20 minutes and take a 10 minutes cat nap. Just rest your body. You can just close your eyes, put on some nice music. Those 10 minutes can add up and right there you already got half an hour. Or maybe you break your meals out into five meals and then there you go, almost an hour of sleep right there. So do take your nap, sleep, 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 you need it. Number three, the third thing that you need to do to make sure that your weight loss actually looks like weight loss, not, oh, does that dress make you look slim a little bit more? <laughs> It is so annoying when you've lost weight and people cannot even tell. I mean, you know you're not doing for the people, but yeah, come on, right? You want that body composition to change? The third thing you want to do is to make sure, please make sure that you're getting your veggies and your fruits. Now, you're supposed to get two and a half cups of veggies and two cups of fruits. We all know this. If you didn't know, you could have Googled it. It's not it's not like a mystery magical thing that you couldn't have found out on yourself by yourself. But the thing is it's really hard. Um on the journey I'm on right now, my carbs are pretty low. Now don't don't be shocked. It's a hundred grams. I know, I know. A hundred grams of carbs. It's pretty low. Um, but it's doable, it's not unhealthy. Okay. However, to get two cups of veggies and one cup of fruits, it is the hardest thing. And I literally just started putting my veggies and my fruits in my diet more intentionally in the last two weeks. I know, look, it's a journey. It's not a race, it's a journey. I'm learning little by little and I just learned about this, so I'm putting it in. So here's what I do, like I said, I plan what I'm gonna eat tomorrow today. I plan my fruits and my veggies first. First the veggies then my fruits and then the rest of my carbs I do other things with it like it will be other source right so now if you want an all video on veggies and fruits and sources of carbs let me know I got you I got you I got some really great things like just some really like you'll be full I promise I got you so let me know in the comment below if you want that number four the fourth thing that you need to do to make sure that people actually see it and you see it right because you don't want to be frustrated right you don't want to be losing weight but not be able to see it right the first thing the fourth thing you want to do is to make sure and I'm begging you on this this might seem inconsequential uh, inconsequential wow I can't talk y'all that goes my English degree. It may seem inconsequential, as in you don't think there's gonna be any consequence for it, but trust me, you need to buy a food scale. Make sure you buy a food scale. Trust me. The labels are great. They're wonderful. But they're not always accurate. They're not always true. It's really for things that you have to cook. After you cook it, it changes rice swells for example our meat shrinks for example so you need to weigh it now if you start weighing if you want when you start weighing if what you weigh is before cooking that's okay but make sure you always weigh that way every single time if you weigh it which is the way i do it after you've cooked it so actually what you're about to put in is what you weigh and it's even better this is especially important for all the macros actually but the thing about it is you might be shorting yourself in protein you're thinking oh i just had 25 grams of protein but really it's 18 because you were trusting the label don't trust label do the work now i know you're like girl ain't nobody got time for that if you love yourself darling make time for it wait i know i know i know i've been doing I did not start weighing initially. I didn't have a foot scale. I got my foot scale like maybe a month ago. Game changer. I thought I was putting a lot of fruit in myself, but I was like, I was showing myself a good 40 grams of protein. What? Not good, right? So make sure that you buy your foot scale 
and you weigh everything as much as possible my coach weighs her egg i know i ain't got time for that <laughs> i ain't got time for that i don't wear my egg i just want egg um i i do make sure i put in my app it's gonna be fried egg or raw egg or boiled egg that one i do but i don't y'all know abby she's she's uh she's the bomb.com um so uh make sure you weigh right and i it doesn't matter if you're doing grams or ounces for me i find that grams is more accurate um and more precise so that's what i use often but when i use ounces it's all good the very last thing that you gotta do to make sure that you are seeing your work that your body composition is changing that you're getting everything in is to trust the process i am not here to help you lose 10 pounds in a week i am not here to help you lose 50 pounds in three months i am here to give you what you need to do the best for yourself and make yourself proud okay so trust the process and when I say trust the process, I mean, make sure that you are consistent. You're tracking everything. Okay. Track everything. And make sure that you are aware that it's not linear. I mean, you're going to go up and down, up and down, but be consistent and it will go like this, right? It's going down. It's just now straight down. That's okay. I do have one bonus thing, and I, I have to say this. If I don't say this, I'm doing you a disservice. I'm not helping you at all. You gotta work out. When you burn your calories from working out, your protein is what builds your muscles, okay? You don't wanna just burn the fat and then have nothing to show for it. You want your body composition to change, then up your protein and combine it with a good workout. You got to work out. That's just the truth of it. Now, if you saw my video, you know that for me, working out is an old process. I have not had an episode in over a week. It's fantastic. I make myself work out. I make myself do it. And the thing that I do that helps me is I look at people that I look up to, like Growy Joe, and then I just adapt what she does and I make it work for me. So I make my body work hard. I just might not work as long as the video will tell me to. I make up my own workout. It's so fun. It's fun. All right, y'all. I love you. Y'all have a wonderful day. Thank you for sticking with me. Ooh, it's been a long, long day. <laughs> Bye. All right. Oh my goodness, y'all. This is about to be the worst video you've ever seen by me. It's kind of ridiculous. Okay. We're using a broken mic, uh, a broken uh, camera stand to do this. So, forgive me. Um, Makeup is rushed because you don't to wake up soon. Okay. Enough excuses. Let's get into it. All right. Is this naturally recording? I don't know. No. Yeah. Yes, it is. Okay. Excuse me why I wipe my face. Now you might think it was number three. Looking at my notes. Okay. Number three. Make sure you sleep. Okay, that sounds better. I don't want to turn off the fan. Uh, yes, it is loud. Oh, Alright, I'm gonna keep this to the end. Like I'm gonna keep all of this. All this blooper. I'm gonna keep the end. So if you seen this part, y'all know what it beginning really looks like or what this looks like. Because this is like those bit the beginning, but it's the end, so. <sighs> it's so hot. I'm like trying not to die. Where are my notes? <sighs> Here we go. Let's do it.
How y'all doing? How y'all doing today? Let me just let's just start with that. Let's just let's just get close. I'm gonna get real close. <laughs> How y'all doing today? Um, as you can tell, um, my setup's a little different. I'm trying to like not let y'all see the laundry behind me. And I'm just gonna be real with y'all. Here's the thing, y'all. For YouTubers, for video creators, <laughs> we go through so much. <laughs> and um, a like, a subscription, a comment is a huge deal for us for us it's like a drop of water in our now emptied bucket of love towards y'all we're pouring into you so just give us a couple drops okay here's the other thing when you give us a like a subscribe um a thumbs up and you ignore the sweat um youtube algorithm because it's not a real person an ai that looks at the numbers and go oh so esolawi is doing something great in the world all right let's put her video in front of other people that might enjoy it right so i really really want to get to 1000 subscribers by christmas okay today it's july 29 let's get esther to 1000 subscribers okay all right so let's do it go ahead and click the subscribe button leave a comment please give me a thumbs up it really does matter to me i'm getting back up on my feet that you showed up was written in my phone you 